Right now, we're standing on the west side of Port Arthur, Texas, located in southeast Texas on the Gulf Coast. West Port Arthur is historically an African-American community. It's a low-income community, people of color. And all my life, uh, we've lived in the shadows of refineries and chemical plants that's located here in our, in our area. We grew up with the smell of sulfur and various other chemicals that are being dumped into our environment. A large number of people are suffering with bronchitis, uh, acute asthma, and also there's a lot of folks in this community with liver, kidney disease, and cancer due to the emissions, I believe, that's being dumped into our air and the types of chemicals that we're breathing. For years, these refineries have been processing crude oil, but what's different about this, this tar sand is that it's heavier in sulfur, it's heavier when it comes to various metals, and also mercury. Once that pipeline is built, all those jobs are gone that they said was gonna bring so much wealth. Those are not permanent jobs. And what we're gonna get is a continuous flow of this tar sand, which is heavy in mercury, heavy in metals, heavy in sulfur, and what it's gonna do is help to increase the negative air quality that we presently have. Port Arthur Westside community is being disproportionately bombarded as it is with toxic waste. We do not need this tar sand coming to our area and increasing the heavy toxins in our environment. It's time to decrease the heavy emissions, not increase.